I'm building an app called Try that connects aspiring competitive gamers with each other in order to build the best esports teams. I started watching a bunch of different TED Talks. So TED Talks on the importance of empathy, passion, the value of being your own boss of entrepreneurship. And I thought to myself, this is something I really, really want to do. I just didn't know how or where to start. Catherine Korkakis, who runs the venture capital fund at Pro Montreal Entrepreneurs, and she put me in touch with CDEC of Cotonej. There I was able to get a first grant from the government of $8,000, and I was immediately able to start redesigning the application, getting new developers, and from there getting good milestones that I could then take to the Pro Montreal Entrepreneurs. I was then able to raise another $50,000. The funding that I got from Pro Montreal Entrepreneurs will help me hire both a web app developer and an iOS developer, and this will help tribe go on multiple platforms. So I'll be able to have a web platform as well as an iPhone app adding to the current Android app. So people will be able to find players around the world that aren't limited to just one platform. They can build the right team from the beginning. The most challenging part of starting a startup is knowing where to start. There's a famous saying, there is no starting or stopping, only doing, which is what helps people just go for it. But you still need to have some sort of direction, some sort of vision. I have three rules in life paradox, humor, and change. And change, uh, it's a reminder that nothing stays the same. So no matter what I do, just keep moving forward. So that's why if I could take a risk and something doesn't go well or my way, just keep going.